Hey everyone, super nice to see you here. Today I want to talk about how to deal with disrespectful people. And we're going to do a bit of a role play. And you're going to pretend that you're my client and I'm your coach. Because I do coach people. So, you have disrespectful people in your life. Is that correct? And you would say, yes, that is. And then I would ask you a couple of questions. So first of all, I would ask you, okay, so what do you think about yourself? Do you respect yourself? And you'd say, yes, of course I do. I'm coming here to you. I'm working on this. I'm, I'm taking a coach because I take this seriously and I take myself seriously. Okay, fair enough, I would say. Um, how do you eat? I eat healthy, you would say. I eat mostly healthy. Yeah, sometimes I eat fries or some, I don't know, um, chocolate or, but that's okay, right? I mean, we also should have, uh, we should also enjoy our lives. And I would say, yeah, you're totally right. And I'm all for that. Okay, I would ask you. Then, do you exercise? Yes, I exercise almost daily and I'm doing very well. And I'm actually training for handstands just like me and uh, it's going really good okay do you dance yeah i dance okay so then um, what do you think of your body uh well okay to be honest i think my feet are a bit too big and my ears are a bit funny don't you think my ears are funny and my hair like i don't know what's going on but it always looks so funny and my teeth i think i should get braces and um, these pimples, I don't know where they come from. And there you have it. Okay, I'm exaggerating a little. But you know, everything that you see outside of you is a movie. You are, your body is the cinema. With your thoughts and with your ideas and with your emotions, you choose the movie. So whatever you're seeing outside has nothing to do with things that you do on the outside. They have everything to do with what happens on the inside. So disrespectful people are people that show you something. It doesn't mean that you have to take whatever they're saying, take it in and just say nothing and leave it. No, what you do is you don't have to do this out loud, out loud, by the way. You say to yourself, to them, oh my God, thank you for showing me where I was out of alignment. And then you either kick them out of your life or not, whatever feels best for you. Like there's no right or wrong. It's your life. You are the creator. You can do whatever you want, but don't kick them really. Like it's a matter of speech. Um, and then you go on working on where you need to work and that is within you and with yourself. So I would give you this advice and I'm giving you this advice and it's what I'm doing myself every single day in the mirror. The first time I look in the mirror, I look into my eyes and I don't look at how funny I look because I just woke up. I look into my eyes deeply and I say my name. Monique, I'm proud of you. The second thing I do is I say, Monique, I am sorry that I'm sometimes so hard on you. And the third thing I say is, Monique, I love you. And that's it. That's how you start creating a better relationship with yourself, with your body, with the cinema that is projecting the movie, your life, and that is chosen by the thoughts, the feelings, and the emotions inside of you. And before I leave you today, I wanna say that it's not your fault, like no one is guilty of anything. It's not about that at all. I would really get those words out of your vocabulary. It has nothing to do with life. Life is about experiencing, about expanding, and about growing. And when you think shitty thoughts, you don't expand, you contract, you get smaller. And when you think loving thoughts, you expand and you get bigger and your energy gets bigger. And that's what it's about. 
so there's no one guilty of anything there's only experience and everyone that's being an asshole is just showing you where you're out of alignment that's it so i trust that this video was helpful i'm wishing you a beautiful rest of the day and i see you in the next one ciao ciao